Here we are from John D. Hansen Stadium in Osseo, Minnesota. I'm Eric Nordquist, and it's the national game of the week. Minneapolis City Soccer Club hosting Med City FC National Premier Soccer League action. Here's your starting 11 versus Med City. It's sponsored by Twin Cities Orthopedics. And in net, it is James Nair making his second straight start for the Crows. Defensively, Charlie Adams to the left. Max Kent and Aaron Olsen, your center backs. Mark Height is your right back in the midfield. Max Stiegwart and Martin Brown handling business. Ben Wexler, number 21 in the midfield as well. Your wingers, Whitney Brown, Isaac Frent, and then up top, Brandon McGarity. Again, that is your starting 11 brought to you by Twin Cities Orthopedics. A couple of players tonight that you'll want to watch. Martin Brown, six assists last season. It was team leading. Keys for him, of course, creating chances, finding space in the midfield, and pushing the game forward into the attacking third for Minneapolis City. And then Isaac Fred, goose they call him, six goals led the team in goals last year. And it's about getting the ball in attacking positions and getting shots on target. You watched the 2-2 draw last week versus Sioux Falls, and it was about finishing chances. That's something against a stingy defensive unit coming from Med City that will be uh, very important for the Crows to secure three points this evening. All alone, Mujic. French shoulder to shoulder battling. He'll cross an open goal for Med City FC. Repetto on the back end, and it is 1 0 for the Medics on the road early on. Just the seventh minute, an early conceding goal. Now he can turn around McGarity, and a goal for Minneapolis City. How was he left open inside the area like that? And so quickly, as shocked as I am, Brandon McGarity able to turn in the box, no one challenging him, Nate Levy, no chance. Into the box. And just over the crossbar. Now it's a one-time whiff by Neto. Ends up potentially being a go-ahead goal for Med City. Nair in the right spot, as he has been for the most part tonight. Now Whitney Brown making Atopolis feel awful. And just to the right of the net, Martin Brown. A deflection. And a save from Levy leads to another corner for the Crows. Now McGarity running through. All he's done is been open. He can get in alone if he's got an opportunity. Wolf fires good. Nearly, nearly a go ahead goal from McGarity. In the first half. The first half has come to a conclusion here at John D. Hansen, and it is 1-1. Now Olsen looking forward. It is McGarity with possession, and he'll take a shot, and it, and it sneaks in the right post. Did Levy think it was going wide? I believe most of us at John D. Hansen thought it was going wide. And that's goal number two. Fifty-sixth minute. Now he'll inside header potentially game is now equal. Is now equal. You have Martin Brown in the seventy-first minute from the spot. Can Nate Levy keep this thing tied, or will Martin Brown take the lead for Minneapolis City? Ref gives it to him. And easily, easily, easily into the right 
side of the net, and it is 3-2 Crows. Height into McGarity. Ooh, Wills fighting for an opportunity. Now Whitney trails him. He'll take it. Looking for Wills. He can shoot or he can distribute. He'll take the shot and it'll be left of the net. Indecisive by Mujic and McGarity takes it away. And Nitopoulos there just in time and it's over. It is done here at John D. Hansen Stadium, your National Game of the Week, National Premier Soccer League action here in Osseo, Minnesota, Minneapolis City. 3-2, the victors over the visiting Med City. Thank you so much for listening and watching a Saturday soccer affair, the National Game of the Week in the MPSL, Minneapolis City 3, Med City 2. I'm Eric Nordquist. So long and have a beautiful day from John D. Hansen Stadium in Osseo, Minnesota. Good night.